Uncovering even more astonishing and disturbing findings, the number of galaxies being observed is far greater than expected, and there seems to be no end in sight, making it feel as though the universe has no clear beginning or end. Some scientists are now saying that it appears as if we're seeing the same universe again or a mirror image of our own near the time of the Big Bang. This is deeply concerning and raises serious questions about whether there is any predictable pattern in the evolution of our universe. Lur Shamir, an associate professor at Kansas State University, has some worrying things to say about the current discoveries made by the James Webb Telescope. He said James Webb, the oldest spiral galaxy telescope, provided deep images of the very early universe, but instead of showing an infant early universe, it showed large and mature galaxies. If the Big Bang happened as scientists initially believed, these galaxies are older than the universe itself. Look at this image here. You can see a galaxy that is blowing scientists' minds. Seriously, it's shaking up everything we thought we knew about how the universe works. It's called Joule Long, and it's just been discovered by astronomers using the James Webb Space Telescope. What's crazy is that this is a fully formed spiral galaxy, and it's the oldest spiral galaxy in the early universe we've ever discovered. It existed when the universe was only about one billion years old. That's super early in cosmic terms. For comparison, our universe is around 13.8 billion years old today. Now, here's the part that's freaking scientists out. Galaxies like this, especially spiral ones with those neat, well-defined arms, aren't supposed to exist so early. According to our current models of how the universe evolved, these kinds of galaxies should take billions of years to form. They're expected to grow slowly over time through a bunch of messy mergers with smaller galaxies. But this galaxy already looks mature. It has a central bulge filled with old stars, a bright disk where new stars are being born, and clear spiral arms just like our own Milky Way. In fact, that's why scientists are calling it the most distant Milky Way twin we've ever seen. Its size and structure just don't make sense based on the standard cosmological model, which is the foundation of how we think the universe formed and evolved. First study author Muin Shao, a postdoctoral researcher at the University of Geneva, said in a statement that what makes Zulong stand out is just how much it resembles the Milky Way both in shape, size, and stellar mass. While Zulong is unquestionably older than the Milky Way, it could be mistaken for our galaxy's little sibling. The new research estimates that Zulong's star-forming disk measures about 60,000 light-years across, compared with our galaxy's 100,000 light-year breadth, and it contains about 100 billion solar masses compared with the Milky Way's 1.5 trillion. Still, Zulong is by far the largest Milky Way lookalike spotted at such an early time in the universe's history. And here's the wild part. It's not just one galaxy like the Milky Way that we found in the early universe. We've actually seen several spiral galaxies that look surprisingly similar to our own popping up way earlier than they should. We've talked before about some of these discoveries like Sears 2112, which the James Webb Space Telescope found in another giant will galaxy in 2023. This galaxy is about 11.7 billion light years away which means we're seeing it as it was when the universe was still really young. Yet, it already had a well-defined spiral shape just like our Milky Way. And just recently, scientists have found another massive galaxy in the early universe that looks like a giant wheel version of our own galaxy. And web data suggests there are many more galaxies like it in the early universe. The discovery of Zulong joins a growing list of well-formed Milky Way-like galaxies spotted by the James Webb Telescope in the early universe. This is a big deal, and honestly, it's a bit of a headache for scientists. According to our current understanding of the universe, galaxies like the Milky Way take billions of years to slowly grow and evolve. Our own galaxy, for example, took about 13 billion years to become what it is today. So, how on Earth, or rather, how in the universe are we seeing galaxies that look just like ours forming only 1 billion years after the Big Bang? It doesn't add up. Some scientists are now asking a really deep question. Why does the early universe seem to mirror the universe we see around us today? It's like we're looking at cosmic twins in the past, and no one really knows how or why they got there so fast. It's making us rethink the timeline of galaxy formation entirely. But hold on, it gets even more surprising. The James Webb Space Telescope has just revealed something that's leaving scientists even more puzzled. In a brand new research paper, Scientists say they've found galaxies that seem to exist way beyond what we thought was possible. 
According to their mysterious galaxies analysis, Webb has detected galaxies at redshift values higher than 15 and possibly even as high as 20. Now, in simple terms, the higher the redshift, the further back in time we're looking. So, a redshift of 15 or more means we're seeing galaxies as they were when the universe was only about 100 million years old, just a blink after the Big Bang. In this latest study, the team carefully selected 10 objects from Webb's Astro Deep JWST catalog. These objects have the right colors and properties to suggest they're sitting at redshift Z equals 15 to 20. That means they're among the earliest galaxies we've ever seen. Now, here's the shocking part. If these galaxies really are that old, then they formed incredibly fast just a few million years after the Big Bang. That's way earlier than our current theories say galaxies should even exist. Scientists are understandably skeptical and cautious. They're now calling for detailed spectroscopy tests to confirm the exact distances and ages of these galaxies. But if those tests confirm what Webb has seen, this could shake the foundations of modern cosmology. Astronomer Cosmin Ely, Gillian Palin, and Catherine F.E. published the results of their infrared observations of the early universe using the James Webb Space Telescope, where they revealed that they uncovered three objects that could be mistaken for galaxies at first glance, but maybe dark stars. This discovery has brought the existence of mysterious dark stars into reality. So, what is a dark star? Well, the very first stars that formed, and this would have been 200 million years after the Big Bang. As a reminder, the universe is 14 billion years old. So, that was very early on. The very first light, the very first objects. They could have been very different from normal stars. Instead of being powered by fusion, they could have been powered by dark matter. And at the center there, you have the very high dark matter concentration with the dark matter particles annihilating with each other. And what that means is whatever they annihilate into gets stuck inside this star. Also, as we already discussed, how Webb's recent observations are revealing that the expansion rate of the early universe doesn't match the rate we see in the nearby or local universe. This mismatch is what scientists call a cosmic tension, and it's becoming harder to ignore. If the universe isn't expanding at a consistent rate everywhere, then it raises a deeply troubling possibility. What if the universe doesn't even have a single fixed age? What if the age of the universe actually varies depending on where you look? This completely challenges our current cosmological models. It suggests that the way we've been measuring the age and evolution of the universe might be fundamentally flawed. And that could mean everything we thought we knew about the universe's beginning needs to be rethought. All these discoveries made by the James Webb Space Telescope have completely shaken up our understanding of the universe. Until recently, scientists believed the early universe was a quiet, dark place with no galaxies for hundreds of millions of years after the Big Bang. But Webb has turned that idea on its head by spotting galaxies that existed just a few hundred million years after the universe began, even during a time once called the Cosmic Dark Ages. Even more surprising, some of these galaxies look just like our Milky Way with spiral arms and fully developed structures. On top of that, Webb Telescope's discovery, which suggests that the expansion of the universe is non-uniform, raises a scary possibility. What if the universe doesn't even have a single age? What if it's older in some places and younger in others? That would mean our basic idea of how the universe began could be completely wrong. These findings have led scientists to consider bold new theories. Some, like Nobel laureate Roger Penrose, suggest our universe might have come from a previous one. Others think there could be a mirror universe that existed before the Big Bang. Some even say the universe might not have had a beginning at all. It could have always existed. There are also ideas that the expansion of the universe might just be an illusion and that mysterious things like dark matter and dark energy might not even exist. That's the end of this video. If you found it interesting and informative, let us know your thoughts in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. Also, if you'd like to support our work, you can do so by purchasing our t-shirts or donating via SuperThanks. Your support helps us create more amazing content. Thank you for watching.